success for the day. So today I'm going to talk about comedy in Kenya. Of recent past, uh, comedy in Kenya has been doing so well, especially when it comes to stand-up comedy. But when it comes to drama that involves some sense of comedy, then we are doing so, so badly off. And that is what I'm going to address today. So I'll quickly run into some points that uh, we can look into to make our comedy industry far much better than what we're doing currently. So this, uh, the first thing I'm going to look at is what I'm going to refer to as the comedy of ethnicity. The comedy, comedy of ethnicity. So, uh, on our screens, what we've been looking at most of the time in our dramas that we have on screen that uh, entail some bit of comedy is where we have boy, a girl or a boy doing some bit of comedy that runs and have must up our game to ensure that whatever we have at the moment is not only sold or does not remain on our shelves that is, but it's something that you can take to other countries even if the media houses in Kenya don't want to show whatever we have I'm a writer, a director and a film producer so I know exactly what it means producing a content that I just put in my shelf or I just store it somewhere on my shelf without taking out of the country or even uh, without getting some airtime anywhere on our TV channels. So, this is the reason as to why I'm going to talk about these points because they are very, very important to us as writers and as directors and even as producers. Because whatever we have there in the doesn't know that we have a lawyer in Kenya, doesn't know that we have a Kikuyu in Kenya or even a Kamba who we saw in. So, what am I supposed to do? I should be working on a piece of comedy that has clear assets. Yeah? Piece of comedy that has clear assets that can cut across. What should we should work on at the moment? I believe is working on scripts that has words that are so comical. I believe this is what is going to sell us, not the assets. I know I'm very sure of the assets. Nope. Probably in our country. But, if, but with our current society, then that is again a dead thing. I don't need those big asses to look like a comedian or place a lot of clothes in my tummy for me to look like a half pose. No, I don't need that. That is dead comedy at the moment. Nobody will be in a position to buy that at the moment. Simply because, okay, for my shiny and all that, if I'm out to sell in my country and probably in my village, oh, it's okay. But if I need to take it somewhere out of this country and my target audience at all is not tight, is useless.